Wait one second, let me take a drink before we properly begin. Make sure I am recording. Wait one second. Okay, I may as well properly begin before I take a drink of water. Hello and welcome back to Minecraft Jungle Paradise Golden Age, episode 258. Hopefully you are all doing okay today and staying safe. Okay, now I'm going to take a drink of water. Only have a dribble at the very bottom. Ah. Ah. Sorry about that, there was something in my water bottle there. Disgusting. Eh, hey, let's see. Hello and welcome back to your know, Minecraft Jungle Paradise Golden Age. Hopefully you are all doing okay today and staying safe. The last episode we started construction of a church. And now we are finishing that today. We also need to maybe comb out a bit of the land to make sure no uh, mobs can spawn. Especially over there. Eh, uh, let's see. So, last episode I explained that I was going to be building in the northern area. So this is basically part two of what we were doing last episode. Uh, let's see. And I want to finish off the church today, but first we have to return back home. Meaning I have to regenerate all the chunks up there, so it might be a little bit laggy, I do apologise. Uh, let's see. Teleport. And we are close by. I'm thinking I might just go up river normally. I do really like this. Ah. You know, there's just something about this little uh, area that I built that's just so calming. Okay, I need to fix my headset. It's been very annoying for a second. Okay, let's see. So, hopefully you are all doing okay today and staying safe. I do really like this build. I wish we could build more stuff like this. But we are busy doing other builds, so, you know, we can't really build anymore. I think I was going to build another area that goes off and maybe connects to this area. My old uh, area where I kept my shulker box. Uh, let's see. Wait, I have a boat, don't I? I have a boat somewhere on me. I might as well use it. Okay, there we go. Okay, but hopefully you are all doing okay today and staying safe. Uh, let's see. So, let's explain what I'm going to be doing today. So, in today's episode, we are going to be doing some work on uh, the desert by building some structures. I was thinking I'm taking a wrong turn. Yeah, I definitely took a wrong turn, but I don't have to stray too far. There's a spider in the woods over there staring at me. Uh, let's see. Bunny over there. Creeper. Hello there, creeper. You going fishing? Ah. Okay. I'm also keeping an eye out for my uh, certain dino bird that is somewhere located over here. That's just a sheep there. I was wondering what it was. Uh, let's see. So, we're going to be making concrete today, placing it in the church, finishing the church getting it over with and then later on I might add some splashes of colour to the church to make it more you know colourful uh, let's see haven't generated this area so it's all loading so I do apologise if it's lagging we got mob issues luckily I think everyone was asleep Okay, luckily everyone was asleep. It looks like there's mobs spawning on top of that roof. And I need to deal with it. So let's deal with it now. Okay. I see this as a serious problem because if any mobs spawn, it means certain death for our great grandchildren. And, uh. My, you know, children. My children, my great-grandchildren, and my grandchildren. Eh, uh, let's see. We also have Bailey. I'm still to marry off Bailey, I think, yeah. I haven't married off Bailey yet. We're also supposed to marry uh, some NPCs soon. But we have to pick what one we want to marry. There's Quincy up there. Hello there, Quincy. How you doing? Eh, uh, let's see. 
So we can either pick from, let's see, hmm. I think it was Catherine, no it's Candy the Farmer, I think that's her name, or Candy the Fisherman, it's Candy the Farmer and Rifa the Fisherman, and then something else for someone else there. Okay. Well, let's get moving because I need to make concrete and I think I know a place to get certain materials for concrete. We must delve deep into the mines of this land that we have built. Yeah, I do really like our house. It just it needs something added, I think. Could add trap doors along this, but yeah, I don't know if that would look nice. Hmm. I still have... A I think I have a few ideas of how we could improve this. But I think I have to add, like, maybe trap doors like there, there, there. Like, for the corner bits. The problem is, I don't really have that many ideas of what I'm going to be doing here. So that means we have to come up with some ideas. And now we descend into the artificial cave. You know, it is really covered. You can't really tell that, you know, it's here when you're looking from this direction. You can kind of see, like, chest behind it when you're looking from the left. But this place is really hidden due to all the vines just overgrowing. Ah, yes, here's the people. You got Candy the Farmer, Reefer the Fisherman, and Rosalina the Guard. We can either pick any three of those, any one of those, for our wife for the series. We have had, like, uh, we had Chuck the uh, Librarian, my first husband, in last. Uh, who was after that? Hmm. I think after that was... What's this? What's her name? I think it was Tawanda? It's either Tawanda, and then after that's uh, Vicky. Tawanda, Vicky... I'm pretty sure there's another one that I married and they also were killed. If you don't know what I mean, I had three lovers in this series. They all died by my hand because we could not... The divorce system requires a priest in this game with the mod and for some reason a priest do not spawn in my world so we had to use the sword on them, sadly. Uh, let's see. Okay, grab some gravel. We do have a lot of gravel, I've just realised that. Problem is we're gonna need a lot of bone meal for white dye. Once we get that done, we have enough concrete for the church. I'm looking forward to the church because after we can construct the church, we're going to do like little splashes of colour. Like it's been, you know, it's like when you throw a tomato a wall and it kind of stains it. We're kind of got to do that with random colours. But you can pick what colour pattern we're going to go with. We can either just, you know, let's do an example here. Huh? So, you know, you have a white wall here. Maybe some red over here. Maybe a little bit green. A green dot. Something like that. Or we could do a colour pattern like, you know, splashes of, you know, colour. Like in a certain order. And I'll let you decide that. Uh, let's see. And then, you know, if, if you don't come up with it, I'll probably delay it for another time. Is my mouse okay? Sorry, it just looked like my mouse had bent one of the plastic bits on it. But no, it's just uh, the outside. Oh, hello there, Wilburn. Totally forgot about you being here. An apple a day keeps the zombies away. Hey, how are you? Uh. We have a serious issue. It's shown that there's a hostile mob up in my room.
No, that's just a pig. There's a noise coming from there. Should something here. I hear mobs, but I don't see the mobs. Let me get back up here. Minecarts. Uh, let's see. For some reason, I think it might be my bird. The only reason why I think it might be my bird is because, uh. If I go like this, does, does it do footsteps? No. Okay. What? Where are those? Hmm. I don't know. For some reason, there's a. Let's see. There's baby zombies somewhere. I don't know what is, but every once in a while I hear baby zombies and then I just can't find them. I think there's something buried within my base that I can't find. Uh, let's see. Hopefully we can solve the issue. I know that there was a zombie problem a long time ago and it was somewhere over here or over here where I found a ravine under my base. But I don't think that's the issue the now. I don't think so. Hmm. So two stacks of sand. I'm going to need the bones, so let's split the bones. Go like that. 42, that should do. That should be enough. Yeah, that should be enough of what we need for concrete. And then, if I have some time at the end of today's episode, I might do some work at home. I totally missed what I was trying to aim for there. Village 1, and it's off in that direction, and I got a straight shot over here. Okay, Dustin, you want to come with me? I totally forgot about, I did this uh, over here. Yeah, I totally forgot about that. And I had to do that weird wall bit there. But this is a pretty good wall. I did talk about expanding maybe later on. Having more, uh, you know, areas of fencing. And I think the next expansion is probably going to that coastline over there. And then up that way and then over the mountain. And connecting it fully to, you know, Mass Halden. Also known as Village 1. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I, I like the name Mass Halden. But maybe we need a rebranding of it. Rename Mass Halden. Just depends. Uh, let's see. I totally forgot about making glass. Dustin! Dustin! Mate, you almost died due to your own stupidity. You stay here. Or if you want, just move around. Move freely. Just chill out. I don't want you to die. I've had too many good friends die on me. I don't want any more. Uh, let's see. I saw that was a horse on the roof there. No, it's just a bit that I put up there to look like a... You know, it tells you what, what, what way is west, north, and all that. North, west, east, and south. North, west, south, east. There. Okay, let's see. just created like a monstrosity there for a second 
Hey, uh, Luggy, could you pick that up for me? Thank you, Luggy. You still have a lot of stuff on you, Luggy. I need to solve that issue. Uh, put that there. Expand this wall a little bit more. Yeah, that should do. Okay, let's see. Do that. And reach that roof bit there. I can't reach it. And there we go. Okay, we're almost done with the church here. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Now how do I want this to go? Hmm. I can either go with like a bit like that. And I go up a little bit like that. That should do. Yeah, I, I kind of like that. Okay, that should work. I have realised that, you know, I've only done, like, kind of just one wall here. And there we go. Break that. And almost done. One more block. There we go. Okay, that should be perfectly fine for that side of the build. I do want to put a window up there, but I'll probably leave that until I, you know, water the entire structure and area. Is that two? I just make it two. The last window's two blocks wide. Okay, let's see. That is working. Okay, not too bad, not too bad at all. Uh, let's see. I quite enjoy this. Uh, let's see. Okay. Go like this. Okay. That should do. And go like that. Okay. Going quite well. Do the side corner bit there. Pop over to that bit. Yeah, it's not actually that bad. The church is going quite well. It's progressing quite fast. And there's not really been any, you know, anything in the way. Uh, let's see. And go like that. And almost there. Nah, just go up like this. Okay, that's actually working out quite well there. Okay, almost done. Okay, just go around like this. And I should have a question of the day. Let me try and think of a question of the day. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, question of the day. What's your favourite Minecraft mod? Now that's my question for you. What is your favourite Minecraft mod? Uh, let's see. Just realised I'm almost out of white concrete powder. Hmm. Have I had to decide what my favourite Minecraft mod is? Probably... Hmm. Hmm. I would go for Twilight Force, but it's not my favourite mod. Oh, I just got a slashback to that old mod back in the day. Do you remember the Nyan Cat mod that they had for the older version of Minecraft? I remember that was one of the mods that I had an idea for uh, what I wanted in Jungle Paradise. Sadly, we did not actually add it into Jungle Paradise. I don't think I could have lived with you know it in the world. 
because it is a hostile mob. Uh, let's see. Go like that. Yeah, that's actually working out quite nicely. I could cut off the edges. Now, if I cut off the edges, it does save on resources. So why won't I do that? Okay, that works out quite nicely. Shave off the sides. Not too bad, not too bad at all. I quite enjoy this build. Uh, let's see. Sandstone. Grab some concrete powder. And let's go back up here. Uh, let's see. And let's finish this off. It's actually going quite fast, this build. Excuse me, Luggy. You're getting in a way a little. Uh, let's see. Luggy, could you uh, move over a little bit? Thank you, Luggy. How do you get up here, Luggy? Did you use teleportation? Or did you not actually fall off and it was my imagination? Uh, let's see. Do you actually... No, I used the fences from you. I thought you still had those fences. I was going to use them. Uh, hmm. Okay. Let's see. Not the usual you know, building material, but it should do, and I should light that up there. I think that's one gonna light up in a second. Okay. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And now I build across using sandstone uh, use a torch on each side that is actually working out quite nicely and go like that not too bad, I actually really enjoy this. I thought it wasn't going to come out as good as uh, good as it has come out. But it actually came out quite nicely. Problem is I don't have any coal. I don't think so. Wait, I do have a stack of coal. Might as well take it. Make some torches. To light up the structure so no mobs can spawn on it. I hate to lose it to mobs. Okay, let's see, hmm. Going to have to grab a bucket of water. And that backpack bit there. Yo, know, how many uh, shulker boxes can I put in uh, our good friend, uh, Luggy? That's my question. Hmm. Probably a lot. Okay, that should work. Camouflage that. Okay. Let there be light. Ish. Don't destroy it. Destroy the torch. Okay, let's do this all the way around the structure. So, one, one. That should actually work out quite nicely. It's actually going quite fast. I thought this would take a lot longer than it actually has. But nope, it's actually taking a lot of less time than I expected. Uh, let's see. And there goes a the torch. Go away, water. Okay. Well, I may as well go light that bit that spotted from above over here. And also this bit that's dangerously mob, you know, 
area ish. Uh, let's see. And like that. And like that. Like that. Okay, that should work. Hmm. Oh wait, did that destroy some of my veins? That's some veins over here. No. Nope. It's it's formed in that cross, look. <laughs> uh Okay, let's see. Well, that's a big problem. For some reason that turned into a fully fledged water bucket. Oh, it was my water bucket, but I never picked it up for some reason. I hate when that happens, it's very annoying. Uh, let's see. Light that up, light that up. That should be perfectly fine. And now I need to head up the stairs of the tower. I do actually see that this is a pretty good uh, tower. It has, you know, taken shape of what it's actually supposed to look like. Uh, let's see. I thought you were gonna die there, mate. I came down for you. It does destroy the veins, but it just recolors. You okay, mate? Oh, Luggy, I totally forgot about you. There we go. Luggy back in the inventory. Almost destroying all of my veins there. And I lost that torch there because it got disintegrated by the holy cactus. Eh, uh, let's see. Totally forgot about that. Just waiting on this loading. To disappear. Okay, I may as well just go up and just go like that. I'm like a painter over here. Oh no. No, no torches were actually harmed in the making of this. Uh, let's see. That's an ostrich. I was wondering what was standing over there for a second. Uh, let's see. The problem is we're not going to be able to put in the glass. Because I don't think I actually put the glass on to cook. You okay, uh, Dustin? You know, Dustin is kind of a weird name, isn't it? Uh, let's see. Hmm. I'm looking for any dark spots that need to be lit up, like this area. Yeah, that should work out. There's a manticore there. I'm running from the manticore that's currently chasing me. In the box, in the box, in the box. I fight it with my fist. Do so much damage to it with my fist. Definitely was not my thorns. Just have a random uh, manticore room in the lands. Okay. I may actually pick that up a second. Nope. It seems like it's going to stay on the ground. Nope. It's going in my inventory. So I may as well release a random manticore into the land. Yo, I do, you know, expect when I walk into this village to see villagers, but you know, sadly, that is not the case. We do have a lot of packed ice, though. Ah. Let's see, hmm. 
let's see. No, I cooked my iron. That's what I cooked, not sand. Sadly. Uh, let's see. There we go. Kick stick, not cook, not kick 64 sand. Cook 64 sand and, you know, if you, if you leave the area it will be lost, so we might as well just chill out here watching this egg hatch. Okay, what could we talk about? Hmm. Oh wait, yeah, actually just hatched right away. Hmm. Okay, I call after someone that I've just met. Bonjour. Bonjour. Yeah. Look how small it is. So smart. Eh, uh, let's see. Well, that's got to cook for a long time, and I don't want to be in the area that long. Oh, yeah, I turned this pink. Totally forgot about that. Uh, we need to get haste applied here. I don't even think I have a stat status effect from this thing. It's supposed to give me regen, but I don't really see regen. Yeah, I don't have regen. Ah, I think it's when you activate it for the first time, you know, it does it. Bonjo, the Manticore, just roams the desert lands. Oh, look at elephant. And from this distance, it does actually look quite nice. Didn't expect it to look that nice, this uh, structure. Uh, let's see. You know what? Let's just make the rest out of uh, sandstone. Let's finish this border. Uh, let's see. And one day I will take over that mountain. The idea is I'm going to let you decide what colour pattern I'm going to use for it. Uh, let's see. That means changing like layer of layer of you know sand to different colours. And I think it's got to be a pretty cool idea. Uh, let's see. So I'm looking forward to it. That's the best I can do. Uh, let's see. But that does actually look quite nice. It does have a bit of, you know, dry bits. Hmm. Should I keep the dry bits? And I will place that torch back where it belongs. I just say, you know, this is, uh, the sun's been bleaching this, uh, white, and it's, you know, it's kind of, you know, made it crispy looking. It's, you know, slowly falling apart, this church. That's kind of the idea. That's my idea. Uh, let's see. Wish I had a podium, you know, area here. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I think I might end today's episode here, because I'm recording this quite late, and... I can't really record for long, but hopefully you've enjoyed today's episode. Have a nice day, safe, have toast apple. Maybe even tomorrow, I just need to keep up the vitamins. Very, very important. And bye-bye. Wait, let me redo that. Have a nice day, safe, have toast apple. Maybe even tomorrow, I just need to keep up the vitamins. Very, very important. And bye-bye. See you next time. Have a nice day. See you. Bye-bye. Wait, did I do that right? Have a nice day, safe, have toast apple. Maybe even tomorrow, I just need to keep up the vitamins. Very, very important. And bye-bye. See you next time. Have a nice day. See you. Bye-bye.